What is going on guys, this is Walsh from OTR Gamer TV and I don't know if most of you guys already know the unreleased hidden list of the vehicles has been released for the um, Diamond, Casino and Resort DLC so as you guys can see there's a few cars that are coming out, the prices are there as well I don't know if this is the exact prices but this picture's been everywhere it's been um, literally on almost everyone's flipping videos and that but this guy seems to know what he's talking about I don't really care about the prices and all that I just care about a few cars that we're going to be talking about today so me, I want to talk about that old school BMW, that Maserati, and then um, a few, there's a Mercedes over there, and a few other things, but we're going to check that out right now, guys. Now, in my previous video, I told you guys there's going to be an Aventador coming, because there's no Aventador in the game. So as you can just tell by these rims on this vehicle, it looks like the SV Aventador mixed with a little bit of a Ferrari from the rims. When it, when you show this type of picture, guys, it looks like a Ferrari. However, you can clearly see from the front and from the back of the car, it looks like an Aventador SV mixed with obviously, you know how Rockstar do, squishy and squash it, make it or something. And if you look carefully, it comes with a roof top down option. So like similar to how the Corvettes are, you know, you've got the roof on and the roof off. When you buy it, you could do that. I'm definitely going to buy it like that. Keep them custom stock rims on it. Take the roof off. Maybe put a spoiler on there. But like I said, I told you the Devo is coming and now you got the Aventador coming. So this guy that's always on my channel talking shit, fuck you, bro. Anyway, moving on to the next cars that are coming that I'm looking forward to is the BMW. So as well as legendary vehicles, you also have the Southern San Andreas vehicles. Now you guys can clearly see the list. I'm going to leave it on there. I'm not going to talk about every single car. You guys can see which ones are the new cars. So you know the Mini and the F-150 are already out. So the no another car that's going to be coming out is the Dodge, it looks like a Dodge Challenger, I could be wrong guys, all Charger, correct me if I'm wrong. You've got the Dodge Demon coming out, the Demon's coming out, that looks beautiful though, you guys can see the price range of that as well. Pretty pricey as well. And then um, you've got a Volvo coming out, a Bel Air at the top in blue, you've got SUV Jeep, no idea what the hell that is, it looks like a Jeep. Um, and then that pinky car, that's already in the game, but I think they made it like, look like a drag car. But the cars that I want to buy from Southern Andreas is going to be this BMW that I'm about to talk about right now. It's the classics of the classics. It's, um, you already know we got a Sentinel Classic already in the game. This is like the older version of it. For those of you that played Vice City, these cars from there, obviously based off the old school BMW, looks amazing though, bro. Like, you know we're going to be hosting car meets with Beamers with these cars and the old school cars, every type of Beamer. So, the next car that I want to be talking about though, is uh, the Maserati truck. Before I move on though, just to let you guys know that car, that BMW that we just showed you right now, is apparently, is according to this guy's prices, the most expensive car out of the new upstate in Southern San Andreas. But that's we have to copy it. It don't matter. These cars are ready to be bought. So I was right about the Aventador. I was right about the Devo. I was right about the Senna. I was waiting for Rolls Races. They dropped the Bentley instead. I was kind of right about the Bentley. And I was right about this bloody Aventador as well. So... Moving on to that Maserati luxury truck. Now, as you guys can see, this Maserati, could be argued for a Jaguar truck, is on the top right of this legendary motors list. Again, pretty pricey, but it's one of those cars that is different, you know? To me, it looks like a Maserati from the side. It's got a bit of a Jag look to it, but, you know, Maseratis and the Jaguars in the game look pretty much similar. So, definitely looking forward to buying that truck, bro. Now, as you guys can see, the whole list is there. I don't have to keep repeating this, guys. Though. Look, you can see the unreleased cars that are coming. I'm not going to be talking about all of them. I might drop them at the end of the video, but you know the center's coming. Uh, there's an AMG coming, and we'll talk about that next. There's a Lotus that we already saw in the trailer. Um, you've seen a few cars that are already in the trailer that are showing up in the images. So if you, if you want me to, I'm going to zoom into the images at the end so you guys can see properly what I'm talking about. But, yeah, pretty much, you know, you've seen the bike. So it's nothing crazy. You know this bike's coming. But moving on to the uh, AMG concept or rally track car, whatever it was, whatever it's called. It's in the, it's in the Crew 2. It's an AMG a rally car, C63. We're going to show that next. There she is, guys. The AMG GT, not AMG GT, AMG C63 touring car. It's called a benefactor in the game. So, you know, it's based off the Mercedes dealership. Um, this car... I'm hoping it's super fast, bro. Like it, it should be technically on paper really, really fast. It's gonna be one of those cars that's unique when they pull up to the casino. Uh, might be outshining the uh, Senna 
and Bugatti. It might be, I think it's one of the most expensive one in the update. According to this guy's price, it's about 2.8 million, so pretty pricey. But again, you don't know if these prices are solid or not, guys. Looking forward to that AMG, G, that AMG C63 touring car. I'm loving it. It looks clean as hell. Now, the next car that I want to show you guys is the Jaguar. There's a new Jaguar coming. Four-door, saline, saloon, whatever you want to call it. Looks, I like it. It looks luxury. Like I said, we're going out with the luxury updates in this in this update. So, this is again from Legendary Motors. Um, we're going to look at this car right now. Now, here you guys can see the four-door Jaguar. It looks like the uh, X-Type. I don't know. I could be wrong, though. But it looks clean. Look, you can see it's got like a, a white wide body going towards it as well on the side. If you look at the arch on the side where the rims are, those rims look nice on it. The color it looks nice on it. But I think we can make it look better. And then you could do a little drag race between the Jags. To be honest, it looks good. I want to try that Maserati truck versus this. But this is another car that I'm looking forward to buy, man. For the car meets that we're going to be hosting every week on GTA 5 non-stop for 88 some days. And then uh, yeah, we're going to be moving forward. But yeah, the car looking clean. What do you guys think of the Jag? I'm thinking it looking clean, you know. Pretty much looks like the um, old Jag in the game, just a little shorter and more sportier. I have a bad feeling that this car is going to be one of the fastest cars in the game. Because it's these stupid looking cars that end up being fast. These normal looking cars, actually. But the next car I want to be talking about is the Dodge Demon. Most of you guys are looking forward to that car anyway, but let's move on to the Dodge Demon. Now, the Demon is going to be available in Southern San Andreas. Uh, not in legendary motorsports now the price tag of this I know it's backwards guys I had to put it backwards but um, the price for this it looks like it's saying 745,000 if you want to see the image probably just rewind the stream you'll see in the beginning but yeah 745k for the Dodge Demon you can, from there it looks like a you know when you can get the Hellcat vinyl on it but the Demon looks pretty much similar to it as well the vinyl I know a lot of my subscribers are going to be looking forward to this and a lot of car muscle car enthusiasts are gonna be buying this as well. It's you know it's not that pricey. It's pretty cheap compared to this update. Um, I'm definitely gonna be copying one. I'm gonna be making it red with the vinyl on it. Red and black is gonna be my color. Or I might make it black and yellow. See what that looks better anyway. But yeah, Dodge Demon. Price tag about seven hundred forty-five thousand. Again, this price tag could be wrong, could be right. You never know. This guy could be chatting pop. I don't know. But looking forward to the Dodge Demon. Trying to see if there's anything different about the car, but it's just pretty much the looking clean, it's looking nice. Could be mistaken for a Hellcat, am I right? I don't know. Let me know. If you dodge guys below, let me know. Now, the rest of the cars I'm about to show you is pretty much you've seen in the trailer. So, this was the Aston Martin slash Spy car. However, from the back, it kind of looks like a 458. But just with that, with that paint job, it looked like a 458. But yeah, we already saw the Aston Martin Spy car in the trailer. That's coming soon. Price tag was already in the picture in the beginning. Um, the next car is obviously the Senna, which was already revealed in the trainer, which I also said was coming, but I mistakenly said it was an Aventador. But there is an Aventador coming. We've already been through this whole phase. And then the next car that was also in the trailer, which I thought would look like a Ferrari slash Lotus, was actually, it is a Lotus without the rooftop. Looks beautiful, actually. I'm going to cut this car meets in this, bro. It looks nice. That color combination as well. And then um, the newer cars that are not released as of yet are the Dodge Challenger. I'm pretty sure this is the Challenger. I could be wrong. If it's a Challenger or a Charger, please let me know. It might be a mistake, but I think I'm right. And then you've got the Volvo, old school. People going to be liking this. Need for Speed, Underground Vibes. And this Jeep, it looks kind of clean and black, but I don't know if I'm going to buy it. I'll probably buy it if it's cheap as hell, but, you know, I need to buy the F-150 first. And uh, it looks good. You've got a couple of vinyls on it as well. And then you have the Bel Air. So the Bel Air, it kind of looks like, you know those Indian rickshaws? You guys might know the name of them. I don't know the name of them, but they've been them Indian rickshaws right now. It looks, it looks. I might buy it. it looks, see, it looks like a taxi, but it's look, it says some Japanese writing on top. I think, nah, it's not. But yeah, it looks like a taxi. So them Indian taxis back in the day. First, I thought like a, like a, a Bel Air. I could be wrong, you know. And then the drag car, that that, that car at the end is a drag car, guys. That car, that weird looking car, one in pink, that's already in the game. They're gonna make it into a drag car. I know a lot of people are gonna be buying that. That has to have some type of mad speed to it. There's no way it's a drag car and it can be slow. But, yeah, like, the cars that I'm still expecting, still waiting for, are going to be the Rolls Race, Cooling and still waiting for that, guys. And then maybe the Drop Top Phantom. Other than that, no new Ferrari, but that Aventador looks like a mixture. 
of a Ferrari and an Aventador. So we got an Aventador, bang, got that correct. Devo got it correct. Senna got it correct. Rosos Queenland still expecting it. Bentley got that correct. And then uh, we're just waiting for the rest, to be honest. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Which cars are you looking forward to drive? Um, yeah, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.